Small businesses are incredibly innovative and will always seek to explore the possibilities of new technology. The capacity for 5G to enable quicker and better connectivity between devices will undoubtedly bring advantages, which those with an entrepreneurial mindset will seek to capitalise on. The tech sector in Northern Ireland is particularly strong, so as a region we are well placed to benefit from 5G. It was positive to see that Belfast one of the first cities in the UK to launch a 5G network, and it is vital that we build on this in terms of future advancement. It is quite difficult to look ahead to predict how technology will change the future, because that will be a very dynamic process driven by individual decisions and consumer choice. However, it is likely that the capacity of 5G will enable changes to digital services, transport, manufacturing, and will impact our economy and society very broadly, perhaps in ways you might not even consider at the moment. The shorter lag time and capacity to incorporate more devices with 5G can create the right conditions for more automation and use of AI, and it'll be interesting to see how precisely businesses respond to this new capability. When I speak to small businesses, there's always an appetite for greater connectivity. They're keen that Northern Ireland is not left behind in terms of technological advancement. There's a hope that the enabling of a mobile action plan will address some existing policy challenges and ensure the benefits of mobile coverage are maximised for Northern Ireland. They are intrigued to know what the difference is between 3G, 4G and 5G. They want to see the rollout of 5G benefit their business and their local community. They are curious about what the technology will mean for them and how they can perhaps grow their business as a result.